Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and I made a couple of videos today about putting a one inch margin or a rectangle around your objects, and I did one manually, I did one with a macro, and I thought this will be a really good one to show people how to make a macro. Uh, so I'm gonna go to Tools and Script, yours might say macros here, and I'm gonna start recording. We're gonna call this one inch. As soon as you say okay, it's, it's started. Select the item, hold down the shift key and double click on your rectangle tool. Take and go to effects and contour, contour the outside 0 0.0 or one inch. Go up to object, break the contour apart and then grab that red line and delete it. No hurry, but go back to tool scripts and stop recording. Now we're gonna take this away. We'll take our contour docker away and we're gonna to go to tools, scripts or macros, scripts now and double click and watch what happens. It put a one inch border. So the one inch from the bottom lowest thing, the one inch from the top and the one inch that, uh, from the left. So we can make, if you're gonna do this a lot, you can make a hotkey, you could right click, assign a keyboard stroke, the, Macros right there, I've already created one that's called just one one. I'm gonna just say okay, but if, let's say, let's just delete it. So make a new shortcut. I'm gonna hit the one key twice. You can't have the one key because it's assigned to something else. So just assign it and say okay. Watch this. I've got these set, I just hit the one one key and I drew a border around those objects. Kind of fun. Hope to learn a little bit. Thank you for watching.